Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing? Man, Antonelli here. What's up, guys? Juan here, and here's a pitching point that I would like to show you because a lot of guys, like way too many guys struggle with this, and I don't understand why. Guys who are off balance within their delivery or have very poor control within their pitching delivery when they're going to home play. Guys who cannot control the movements very well, who are off balance, may not be strong enough to start adding different types of wacky movements inside of their delivery. And there is nothing better, I'm telling you, there's nothing better than to simplify the move. And what we have here, what you see a lot with younger kids, is they have a very wide rocker step. And when we have a very wide rocker step here, Right, look at my head and look at my balance point. My balance comes all the way over here and now I have to work myself back in this direction to then throw a deliver a pitch into that direction there. And what we see a lot with younger athletes who aren't really physically developed enough to perform that move well because they don't have the motor skills for it just yet is that they get all the way over here and then they have to work all the way back over here. And now my balance is on my toe. And my balance is on my toe in this direction here with me mentally knowing that I need to deliver a pitch that way. And what happens when I have to deliver a pitch that way? Everything has to leak open in order to deliver a pitch that way. And it's not very effective. Your arm's going to drag. You're going to be incredibly inconsistent with arm slot and all that because our motor skills just aren't there yet. So the number one suggestion I have for guys who have a very wide rocker step here and then have to pivot and start working all the way over here and then rounding themselves to home plate is just simplify the move. There's no better way to fix this than just doing a small move. And I see this way too much where guys are really struggling with their command at younger levels because they don't have the motor skills to deliver that move and they don't have the idea and the physical capability of delivering this move just yet where all I ask them to do, hey, let's have a shorter rocker step within our delivery. So it's small, small, small move, small move. And now I'm in a better spot to be balanced and controlled throughout my delivery, as opposed to a incredibly wide move and then having a pivot and look at where my balance is all the way back here. And in order to get to a proper leg lift, now I have to work all the way back over here. And I'm just not there yet as an athlete to perform that move well so keep an eye out to those youngsters coaches out there or if you're a youngster you're 10 years old nine years old and you struggle with command sometimes your feet are the answer sometimes you put yourself in a very poor position to deliver a pitch from the get-go by having way too much of a dynamic move here and now i'm all out of whack and i'm just not physically there to deliver a pitch effectively. You see a lot of major, some major leaguers do this move, but you have to remember they're really incredible special athletes. And at nine, 10, 11 years old, we're just not there yet. Doesn't mean you're not gonna get there. You're just not there yet. Because motor skills and development of the body is starting at that age. And we're just not there yet and that's okay. So the best thing you can do for yourself is just simplify the move. Small step, small step, and then go through your delivery as normal. And I promise you will find yourself much more balanced and much more well-controlled throughout your delivery to be more effective within the strike zones and the quadrants of the strike zone. You'll have more command.